The race for governor is underway, and of course, KSNT News is your local election headquarters. And as a part of that, we take you to the Democratic debate. That's right. And tonight, our Capitol Bureau Chief Courtney Ryan tells us what happened during this first debate in Wichita. This room was packed as the candidates talked about how they could improve the state. And while they agreed broadly on most topics, some of the candidates faced pushback when it came to their stance on abortion. State Senator Laura Kelly, former Wichita Mayor Carl Brewer, and former Secretary of Agriculture Josh Swati spent an hour and a half debating a wide range of topics from improving the education system, major believer in early childhood intervention and prevention, to holding DCF more accountable. We need an independent state auditor looking at these state agencies constantly. And while they all agreed on expanding Medicaid and supporting the legalization of medical marijuana, the two of us are pro-choice and always have been. I can't say that for the others. Swati faced pushback from the others after saying he would veto any new bills restricting abortion. When Swati was a House member, he had an anti-abortion voting record. Uh, that this state of Kansas should not be spending our time passing blatantly unconstitutional legislation like the Font Bill or the dismemberment bill. Brewer followed Swati saying voters won't have to question his position on the subject. And there's no deviation. Well, don't stand up and say that you are. Just tell the truth. Kelly said Swati's veto promise doesn't go far enough. We need to get women their rights back. This is the first Democratic primary the state has seen in about 20 years. Tonight's debate was hosted by the 4th District Democrats. The primary, of course, takes place on August 7th. Reporting in Wichita, I'm Courtney Ryan.